Hello guys, welcome back to Planet Him. Welcome back to Let's Talk. Today, you guys, we have a few things to get into as far as Shadow High goes. I'm so excited to hop into this. So go ahead, grab your drinks, grab your snack, grab your smoke, and let's hop into the tea. Ah, ah, before we do that though, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Go ahead and make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, you're going to want to make sure you're tuning in here because it's a, it's a good time. It's a good show. You guys come, we kiki, and we talk about dolls. Period. So go ahead and like, comment, subscribe. Also, turn on my post notifications. Now, let's get into this video. I'm the manager. Who the fuck are you? Okay, so all the pictures I'm going to be using in today's video are from ash.silverstone2022 on Instagram. Now, look here, child. I have a bone to pick. Okay, so I seen someone say, okay, let me not, let me not get too ahead of myself because maybe this was just like, maybe they don't really know. Like maybe it was just like a rumor. I don't know if, how true it is, but I heard that these might be $32. I don't know if these are the Series 2 dolls or what. I don't see a second outfit. I don't even see a stand, but there probably is one in there somewhere. I don't know. But if these are $32 and they don't come with a second outfit, I don't know how I feel about that. Like, the fact, and it's, a, it's really the problem, that the fact that they have came with second outfits before. You know? Because, like, the dolls are really good quality and everything, but it's the fact that they already, there's dolls that they've made that they were $30 and they came with second outfits and stands and all that stuff. And these don't look to seem like they come with that. But I don't know, maybe they are cheaper than that. That might not be the actual price, you know? Like maybe there's a little bit more going on in the box. Maybe this is just like a prototype or like kind of like an early look at what, what's going on. I have no idea. But let's go ahead and zoom into each individual picture and talk about the dolls. First up, we have Miss Dia. I don't know how to pronounce her last name. I don't know if it's Monte, Monty, or M Mont. I have no idea. We just have to. I just, we're just gonna have to wait and see. Um, as far as the doll though, I do think her color is very interesting. Like I think I don't know. I'm not completely against it. Honestly, I'm not completely against like the super dark purple. It's definitely very interesting. She does look a little sick, but like she looks cute. And honestly, I've been waiting for a doll with short hair and we finally have one. I don't know why, but I just feel like them putting short, I don't know, because they don't do short hair. So I feel like a, at least one doll with like short hair is, is cute. It's cute. Her hair seems to have tinsel in it, but honestly, I like her. She's cute. I wonder if these dolls are going to be a part of series two though. Cause, Cause we do have a glitch doll, which I'm so excited about. Cause I love glitch. Okay, I love glitch, especially after that last episode when she was up there giving us very much performance. I was living for it. But back, back to Dia. Okay, I like the outfit. Honestly, I really, really do. Okay, I first off, I love the the leggings, and then it looks like under her shirt that she's wearing, it looks like she has like that same kind of like netted material, but it's like an undershirt sort of thing. That's cute. That's cute. And then like the coat and then like her, I don't, I can't tell if that's a dress or if maybe that's like a shirt and shorts. I don't know. I can't really like tell necessarily, but that's cute. I like her outfit and her hair is really, really cute too. Yeah, she looks cute. Like she, the color is definitely interesting. Okay. It just, it's definitely interesting, but like, I can't hate on her. Like she, she looks good. And then like the black boots, like she's, she's a vibe. She looks like she has tinsel in her hair. Like, I don't know. She, I mean, she looks good. I mean, what do you think? Um, I think overall I would give Miss Girl about a good, mm, probably six out of 10. Yeah, I would give her a good six out of 10. I don't know. I really love her jacket though. I feel like a part of me feels like I would really, really like her in person. Yeah. No, 100%. I feel like I would definitely like her in person. It's just so interesting that there's not another outfit. <laughs> yeah, it's just really interesting. Um, I do like her boots. I, mean, I can't really see them, but they're black and look like, looks like she has like shoestrings. And I already live for that already. You don't even got to show me <laughs> any more of it. Okay, I like the boots or the shoes, whatever they are. I'm vibing with it. Okay, so next up we have Shadow High Bella. I mean, Carla. Um, I think that she is really, really cute. Okay, I love her vibe. I love her hair. I like the makeup. Um, I really like her little fan that she has. Um, she is just a vibe. Honestly, she's giving very much like classy, like she has a meeting she has to go to. Yeah, she has some business meetings. That's very much what her outfit is getting. Like, I, oh, the, the collar. Does she have a tie too? I can't really tell. 
I'm trying to like look really, really close. I can't really tell, but it looks like she possibly could have a tie. I love her dress, her shoes. Her shoes are everything, okay? Now, this might be a stretch, but she does have white eyelashes, so I don't know if that means she's albino or if that was just like a design thing. Like, they just, they just kind of decided on that for her. I don't know, but we all know, like, Delilah has white eyelashes because she's albino, so I don't know if this character is supposed to be albino, too. If she is, I live for that, you know? That's cool or whatever. Um, She looks good. I don't know. I don't have anything bad to say about her. I mean, she... I mean, look at her. And there's not really much else to say. Like, she, she's real sickening. I, you can just tell the layers and, and the layering and the details are definitely there. The face is everything. I really do like the hair color. I feel like it's even lighter than Bella's, too, which is which is, which is is nice. Yeah, which, which is really, really nice. It's really just the outfit for me. Like, she kind of gives me, like, would you call this, like, preppy? Like, is this preppy in a way? I mean, yeah, kind of, I guess, like, kind of just like Bella, just shadow high. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. But she's cute. Um, I think my favorite part of her is definitely her outfits. Her fan is really, really cute, too, and I feel like it really fits her vibe. I think the bar box art is definitely interesting, like the whole black and white sort of theme. I really hope these aren't $32. I hope they're like a good maybe like 20 Maybe 25, like, I think even that's, like, <laughs> kind of pushing it a little bit, but I don't know. Around that area will be fine. I think they could think that would be a cute little moment. Yeah. Yeah, but she's cute. Um, I think I would give her a good, um, probably a good 7 out of 10. Yeah, yeah, she's definitely everything. Um, I just really hope these dolls really aren't $32, especially if they're not, there's not going to be a second outfit. And it doesn't look like there's a stand, but there could very much could be one in there, but... I don't know. I really hope they're not $32. So I just want to zoom in just a little bit. It does look like she comes with the, um, a, uh, uh, oh my gosh, what is it called? A tie. Yeah, I love that. Um, the outfit's cute. Yeah, it definitely, it definitely is. Okay, so let's get into Glitch. Okay, so here's Glitch. Um, I think it's, I don't, okay. So I don't see the, um, hair chains and jewelry and all that stuff. So I don't know if they like, I don't know. Maybe I, it's just like too dark to see. Maybe she really doesn't have them. I can't really make out what's going on for real, for real. So we're just gonna have to like wait and see, but I don't see anything, but um, she looks good. Okay. I think they changed up her vibe a little bit just from her outfit in the show. Um, the sleeves are pretty much the same. Like She does have those same like glitchy sleeve, sleeve shirt. And then her, um, her leggings kind of remind me of her socks because her socks had like the same glitch glitch pattern on there. So it's kind of mm, like the, in the show she has socks, but like here they're just leggings. And her skirt's definitely different. Yeah, her skirt's definitely different. Her shirt's definitely different. Um, yeah, I mean, she doesn't look bad or anything. I do love her. I love her character in the show, though. Yeah, glitch is definitely everything. I'm really excited for her. Only thing like... It just feels a little boring. I don't know. Like it, maybe she just needs like a necklace or something. Maybe some some bracelets. Maybe even a belt. I don't know. Like there's just it doesn't seem like there's a lot going on right here. But I don't know. Maybe things could change. Maybe things would be a little different. I have no idea. But just from what we're seeing right here, mm, I don't know. It's it's just a little boring. But like she does look cute though. Like I can't deny that she does. She she does look cute. Um, over to the right, right here, that could very well be a stand. Uh, I can't really tell, but you see like that little black thing, or that, that that could probably be a stand. Okay, so that that she they might come with stands. Um, I know people have been saying that these are probably series two. Only thing that makes me question that is I don't see series two up top where the little um name is at. It doesn't say series two. It's like this little lock key sort of thing right there. Um, yeah. So I don't know. I don't know if these are series two dolls or what. Um, I like her earrings a lot. They look like they kind of are like um, Naomi's earrings. That's what it's looking like from right here. I love her face. Okay, I love her face. Her lipstick is everything. So looking at the pick, uh, I'm mean, at the boxes. Um, they don't have any like specific branding for like what line they could be a part of. So these could very well be the series two dolls, you know. But 
I don't know, just super interesting that they don't come with second outfits. That's the only, like, part that's like, mm, okay. I mean, all right. <laughs> um, I do like where they're kind of taking Shadow High now. I know a lot of people have been complaining because they feel like they're starting to add a lot of color, which they are. They are. But with the with the whole monochromatic, all black and gray, all grayscale dolls, I mean, wouldn't that get boring after a while? So then changing it up and giving this girl purple skin and... and and this girl in the middle, pink skin. Like, I don't know. It's, 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 it's interesting. It's fun. You know, it's different for Rainbow High, Shadow High. Um, I'm living for it, though. Like, I don't know. I'm not against it. Okay. Um, will I be getting these dolls? Hmm, maybe. I don't know. I'm kind of, like, overwhelmed with all the releases, honestly. Because, like, it's, it's to the point where Rainbow High, Shadow High, they're, like, releasing stuff dang near every month or every other month. I don't know. It's like, <laughs> there's just, I don't know. I really don't know. I don't know, but we're going to see, I guess. Um, I'm definitely excited to see what the dolls are going to look like, you know. Um, I would love to have second outfits, but, I mean, if they don't come in second outfits, then, I mean, hey, it is what it is. It's just interesting if they don't, you know. But we'll see. But I want to know are you guys' thoughts and opinions down below. Who's your favorite? Are you going to get them? Like, how do you feel about them? Go ahead and rank them down below. Um, tell me how you feel about them. But I want to hear all you guys' thoughts and opinions down below. Please make sure you guys go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe to support my channel. And make sure you guys are always being yourself and staying true to who you are because you are yourself that at least. Peace, y'all.